So he's talking about thought crime, right? Well, again, anyone who is against Esau's image and his mark would be like a thought criminal. The fact that we're teaching this, this, this gospel in the eyes of the top wicked elite, we are thought criminals because we're against Esau's state, we're against his image, which is the new world order, and we're against his mark because the heavenly father is against his image and his mark. You know, we're for Yahweh Shai's kingdom, we're not for Esau's kingdom. We want to see Esau's kingdom be destroyed. So, does that make us friends to the top wicked elite? The answer is no. That makes us their enemies. So eventually they will come for us. They will come after us. And even us brothers, we already got a taste of that on the very day of 9-11 when they came for us. They came for us at the school. Okay, and eight of us were arrested. We always tell the account of what happened. So this thing is very real, man. Okay, this is not a, a, a joke. This is deadly serious. And you, you brothers out there, your sisters as well, you should prepare in your minds for what may very well be possible. You know, all of us are going to have to face our darkest hour in this ministry. Let me say that one more time. All of us are going to have to face our darkest hour in this ministry. We're going to gonna have the ultimate test of faith. You will have the ultimate test of faith. There's no doubt about it. Remember, you've been warned, okay? Yahweh Bashim Yahshua put the spirit on men like us, begin to fell the apostle town down here at GMS to, to paint the real reality of being in this knowledge, being in this truth. While these other Israelite groups have got their head up their ass, you have to wonder what kind of spirit they're in. You get the real reality here, okay? Okay, 
Yeah, which shall come upon all the hour of temptation. Well, Esau is going to make this thing mandatory all over the world. That taking of that chip, which is the elite mark of the New World Order. This is according to Terry Cook. And anyone who doesn't take it is susceptible to being put to death by a guillotine and other forms of torture. You know, all of us is going to have to deal with this Room 101. Now, again, if you know, you know. If you know about the movie and the book, you know Room 101 was the torture room. You know, individuals that was against the state were sent to Room 101 to be tortured. Okay, so again, I also will keep thee from the hour of temptation which shall come upon all the world to try them that dwell upon the earth. And scripture, or the Holy Scriptures is our comforter. And this is what it says. It says, fear not them that can kill. Uh, let me see if I can find it. So we're not even supposed to fear even death. like it was within Esau's power back then when they were terrorizing Yahushai. Yahushai even told him that it's, it is within your power to do what you're doing to me. Yahushai told Pontius Pilate that. He said, you could have no power over me unless the Heavenly Father gave it to you. But if this is your hour to do what you're doing. Plus prophecy had to be fulfilled. So it's going to happen again to the men of Yahushai. Yahushai said, if they have persecuted me, they will persecute you also. Psalms 1, 18 and 6. The Lord is on my side. I will not fear. What what can man do unto me? So even if they say, well, we're going to kill you, like they're about to kill Parsons <laughs> in, that, in that scene, uh, we'll say, well, you know, if, if it is the will of Yahweh washing Yahweh Shai for you to kill me, then go ahead and kill me. To do thy will, O God. Give all praise to Yahweh Hashem, Yahweh Shai, Hashem, Hashem, in the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. The same was in the beginning with God. All things were made by Him, and without Him was not anything made that was made. In His life...